following a bombshell report that ITV's dynamic duo Philip Schofield, 61, and Holly Willoughby, 42, are not as close as they used to be, it seems there are fears for the future of their friendship. Philip recently issued a lengthy, heartfelt statement where he described Holly as his rock but admitted things had been difficult for them both in recent times. Holly was reportedly blindsided by the statement, and has yet to comment on the rumors of a rift between the pair. On Monday, the stars managed to present the show with a smile, but many viewers spotted tension under the surface. Holly is making eye contact with Phil but you can see the discomfort in her eyes. I feel for her, wrote one Twitter user. While another penned, the Holly and Phil partnership is doomed, look how awkward they now are together on this morning, the chemistry has gone toxic. This is not the first time Philip has been embroiled in a fallout with another celeb or his fellow This Morning presenters. Express.co.uk looks back on some of the star's most public spats with stars including GB News Eamon Holmes, Britain's Got Talent's Amanda Holden and IMA celebs Lady Colin Campbell. Fern Britton Philip and Fern presented ITV's This Morning together from 2002 to 2009, after which time the latter host appeared to leave the series rather abruptly. The stars appeared to be the best of friends during their time on the show, but it seems things soured shortly before Fern's exit. In his biography, Life is What You Make It, Philip claimed their fallout had stemmed from an argument over the content of a This Morning episode. He wrote, I walked back into the makeup room and calmly said, please don't do that to me again. I think, for whatever reason, that was the point Fern decided she didn't want to do This Morning anymore. He also said he tried to make things right between them and that he misses her deeply. Meanwhile, Fern said of the incident, something happened and I thought, that's it really, and I walked away and resigned. I was treated pretty poorly, actually, she told the Ray Darcy show in 2020. And after a while I just thought, sod it. Ruth Langsford This morning star Ruth Langsford went as far as to file an official complaint about Philip back in 2019. The ITV star cut her off when she was completing a review of her show Loose Women during an episode of This Morning. While it was claimed she had been cut off due to running short of time, she shot back that she had about three more words to say, leaving viewers feeling uncomfortable. Fans also noticed the pair looked awkward when they accepted their awards together at the NTAs. Don't miss. Philip Schofield's colleagues fear Hess shell of himself in row. News Sue Radford addresses criticism ahead of another family holiday. Latest Harry and Meghan enjoy date with Hollywood pals after coronation. News Eamon Holmes' former This Morning star Eamon hasn't held back when it comes to criticizing Philip in the past. Eamon and his wife Ruth used to present the show together on Fridays from 2006 all the way up until 2020, after which time they were replaced by Dermot O'Leary and Alison Hammond. Eamon, who also accused ITV of lying about his show exit in the past, suggested his former colleague is very passive-aggressive. He told the Daily Mail's Weekend magazine, Philip is renowned for snubbing people. He is very passive-aggressive. It's up to Ruth to say how she felt, but I was feeling hurt for her. No one would have snubbed me like that, he added in defense of his wife. I have a good Belfast street fighter in me. I would be direct. I don't go for presenters who think they have a special privilege or aura or influence. 
Kim Woodburn following her celebrity Big Brother in 2018, Kim appeared on This Morning to talk about her experience, but things quickly became tense between Philip and herself. During the interview, she claimed housemates had picked on her because she arrived later than others in the process, but when Philip pointed out that Chloe Ferry and Jessica Cunningham were also latecomers, things turned sour. You see Philip you were not in there, Kim fumed. I know what I went through, I went through hell on this earth. Not to be deterred, Philip then asked Kim whether she would have got on better with the housemates if she was nicer. I think I am a nice person, she insisted. I'd like you to have a word with all the crew I've ever worked with and these people in the studio. In very very polite, Philip then jokingly asked if Kim felt bullied during their interview of her, to which Kim replied, you are giving me the impression from the time I came on here. You don't know what you're talking about Phil. He then added, I know why people reacted in the way that they reacted to you because of the way you make me feel sitting on that sofa. You're already making me feel confrontational. Since reports of the fallout between Philip and Holly, Kim appeared on GB News to talk about the This Morning presenters. During a chat with Dan Wooten, she raged, I've had so many run-ins. Hess an obnoxious, horrible man and I don't know why Hess still on television. I went on his show and he insulted me, he was rude, he was horrible. He was laughing at me, he was actually snickering at me. He should not be on television, Hess a cruel, brutal little man and Hess full of himself. Amanda Holden in 2018, Holly took a break from this morning to co-host I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here, with Declan Donnelly while Ant McPartland took time off from the show due to personal reasons following his conviction for drunk driving. Apparently, Amanda was a favorite to step in for Holly, but it was Rochelle Humes who ended up co-hosting the show with Philip. The Britain's Got Talent reportedly lost out on the gig because Philip did not want her for the role. On an episode of her Heart Breakfast show in 2019, Amanda joked about the things she never wants to find in her home, listing, spiders, flies and Philip Schofield. She also spoke to her co-host Jamie Theakston about the situation, claiming, I did offer to meet him for a coffee months ago. He didn't reply to my text. What can I say? Philip hinted at why he may not have wanted to host the show with Amanda back in 2014, telling Heat magazine, she has a faulty edit button and she forgets she's on the telly, which is enormously endearing and funny, but occasionally quite scary. Lady Colin Campbell I'm a celebrity. Get me out of here. Contestant previously told The Express, I leave it up to Ofcom to deal with the fact that the public complained about his appalling behavior towards me. Her comments came after the pair clashed over her unofficial tell-all book about Meghan Markle and Prince Harry, which resulted in 15 This Morning viewers complaining to Ofcom. The interview saw Philip refer to the book on the Sussexes as gossip and called her tawdry and undignified, which prompted the socialite to hit back by calling him ignorant. I will leave it up to Ofcom to deal with him, she continued. I do not wish to give that creep any more attention than he deserves. As far as I'm concerned, he deserves none. In an interview with The Mirror, the star also claimed the ITV star had attempted to shove her at the 2016 National Television Awards after party, which she attended with Sunday Mazzietti. I was in a walkway, and Philip Schofield bounced into me, shoved me, trying to knock me down, obviously so I would look ridiculous or people would think I was drunk or some such thing, she recalled. I 
said to him excuse me, but I didn't know who it was until he'd walked past. I realized he'd done it deliberately, and Dima confirmed he had done it deliberately. Express.co.uk contacted Philips reps at the time of these disputes. 